Hi guys, uh, I'm sitting here in the lobby and uh, I'm waiting on James to show up. Uh, he was supposed to show up about 1 o'clock today. He had mentioned about 1. And it's about 4 o'clock now. So, um, so far he's 3 hours late. And he, uh, he was just 3 hours late. Uh, I believe it was 2 days ago that he was 3 hours late. And, uh, so, this is becoming the norm, or I really don't know if he's going to show up at all. I mean, I have no idea. I don't know what he's doing, and I guess he wants to keep it that way. Uh, I hope he's having fun. Uh, it's just a waiting game. He knows I'm checked out, and he knows I'm sitting here. He knows that I haven't eaten all day long. That I'm waiting for him because he's supposed to take me to dinner, but he's nowhere to be found. So um, I'll keep you guys posted, let you know if he shows up or not. Um, it's not looking good right now, but uh, at least I'm in a safe place. You know, I'm not going to die or anything. So um, that's it. Um, that's what's going on here in Tunica, Mississippi. You know, he's being his normal self, which is detached. He's way more detached than I am. And uh, this is just no it's pretty normal for him to, to act the way that he's acting right now. I mean, he's always up to something. He's always acting all kinds of different ways. And you just have to deal with it if you, if you care about him. You have to suffer through it and deal with it. That's what I'm doing. So, uh, I'll let you know what happens next. I'll keep you guys posted. But in the meantime, sitting here at the lovely Fitzgerald's in Tunica, I'm checked out, sitting in the lobby, waiting for James. <laughs>